Hey everyone, I just received my March 2015 Love With Food box and I wanted to share it with you all. So as you know, this is a tasting box and it's $10 a month plus $2 shipping. So as you know, the Love With Food box comes in this red cardboard box. And once you open it up, this is what it looks like. So for the month of March, it was curated by Healthy Grocery Girl, Megan Roosevelt. And it just has a list of the products um, of the items that she picked out in this month's box. So we'll just go ahead and jump right in. The first item is this Two Degrees Chocolate Banana Mini Snack Bar. Next is this Miracle Tree Organic Mint Tea. Next is from Two Moms in the Raw and it's the Almond Butter Cacao Truffle. The next item is from The Good Bean and it's Roasted Chickpeas with Sea Salt. Next is from Annie's Organics, and it's the Bunny Grams in Chocolate. The next item is from Good Boy Organics, and this is the Bops Sea Salt Chips. Next is from Hemp Hearts, and it's Raw Shelled Hemp Seeds. That's a little bit sad. <laughs> The next item is from 180 Degrees, and it's the Nutty Rice Bites with Cranberries. The next item are three cho Choco Chews from True Joy. And the last item in this month's box is the Spice Hunter Herbs de Provence blend. Again, kind of sad. And then, of course, there's just a bunch of coupons and gift cards and pamphlets and stuff at the bottom so to be honest this was probably the most underwhelming box I've received in a really long time because number one these two were essentially free samples so you can't even consider those to be products in the box um, we've received this snack before in the blueberry flavor so again it's not really introducing me to anything new um, We've received this exact product in a previous Love With Food box, and I've been subscribed to Love With Food for about three years, so I have a good idea when a lot of snacks are being reused, so that's kind of disappointing. Um, this you can get at your typical grocery store, but I like these, so I have no problems with this one. We've also received the Good Bean before in a previous box, and I didn't like them at all, so I'm kind of disappointed to see those again. Um, as for these... I'm, I'm excited to try these out because I love Coco and I've seen this brand before so I'm looking forward to trying that out. And then we received two degree snacks before and they was, those are pretty good so I'm thinking the chocolate banana flavor will be really good as well. And then lastly the tea. Again not a big fan of tea so I'll probably be passing this on. But I'm really disappointed in her curation of the box this month so I'm hoping she won't carry it any more future boxes, but that's just my opinion. Um, thanks for watching. Bye.